one more time more thinker I'm here to explain how to create a table using a database query uh, first we have to open the SQL Server 2012 and then go to con connect you have just to wait and then ok and then you have to go to the database right click in your database and then you wait a little bit ok and then this test box we have to write the name of our database in this case I'm gonna write test then we have to press ok wait a little bit my PC is slow because I'm doing the video and then we have to go to database and then expand expand the database ok as you can see we find the name of the, our database already created here the test and then we go to right click go to new query and then press and then just wait, okay and then the scenario the place where we're gonna write our code is gonna be open and then we have to create the basic of create statement that is the create table we can after create table have to put the name of our table in this case I'm gonna put employee but I'm, I'm just going to write imp and then we have to open break open break and then we have to write the first field of our table that is imp id imp id is gonna be our primary key we have to specify and then first we have to put our data type in this case we can choose char char 8 char 8 and then after after the data type we'll have to specify our primary key that is gonna write primary primary key and primary key and then after we write after we type uh, primary key we have to type our constraint that is gonna be not now and then we're gonna put the comma and then we're gonna write uh, an, another field that is imp name imp name after imp name you have to write the data type of imp name that's in this case gonna be var sure for sure 25 you can put a, a, another number but i'm putting 25 because the name is won't be that big okay and then we're gonna put comma and then I feel uh, you can put imp imp number well, imp number in this case we can write integer as data type and then we're gonna close the bracket and semicolon everything is created now it is just we have just to select our code and then execute Execute as you can see command complete successful our our table is already created. If you want to check your table you have to try you have to type the phone code select star from imp imp that is the name of our our table and then you have to select everything and then execute as you can see you can find our table is created in ID, imp name and imp number if you want to insert that inside of your table you have to type the insert statement that is insert insert into imp values and then inside this bracket you gonna write the data that you want to put in your table in this case I'm, I'm gonna choose my own data in this case for imp id you, uh, I can write e01 you, 
for Varsha, we have to put always this single quotation mark. I'm gonna do a video all, uh, about the data types. <coughs> Poma, another single quotation mark for name. In this case, we can write Antonio. Antonio. And then we're gonna put comma when the input number is an inch we don't need to put the single quotation mark we have just to type the number in this case i'm gonna choose this 22 for number as you can see there is no arrow you have to select this and then execute just let wait here. as you can see one row affected as you put you put it, the data already inside your table. If you want to see your da the data that you put in your table, in your table, you have just to go to this code that you type, select, and then execute. As you can see, this your one in turn you turn to inside of your table. Okay, if you want to know, I'm gonna do the next video. I'll, the next video, I'm gonna explain how to put uh, a foreign key. In how to alter your table, how to do a select statement. Just you, the thing that you have to do is to subscribe in channel, like this video, share, and then and put the like in the <laughs> below. Yeah, everything about the SQ Server, um, C Sharp, Java, everything about programming. I'm um, I'm checking this channel. How about you guys that um share the videos that I'm putting in my channel and subscribe to the channel see you see you until the next video Aula. bye bye